Hi everybody and welcome to Australian Mining for New Starters. Today's best shot question is why if you're only looking at coal and iron ore for your new starter job then you could be chasing your tail for the next 12 months. Um, there's no easy way around this. Uh, with the coal and iron ore jobs there's only a couple of hundred of these new starter jobs come up each year and there's literally tens of thousands of people chasing these jobs. And so it's just a numbers crunch. And so if you're trying to exclusively just get into that area of the industry, then, you know, people make a, a hobby out of it. And you see people have been trying for years and years and years without success. So my suggestion is if you are only looking at that area and you really do want to start in the industry, then you should be having a look at Hard Rock Underground. Um, that's where there's lots of jobs at the moment and new starter jobs because they're having to open up new mines. Um, whereas with coal and iron ore, um, the mines that they are, they are opening, there are a few new coal mines opening up, but they're not, you know, thousands of jobs going. Um, it's only a few hundred. Whereas with hard rock underground and in the open pits, there is literally thousands of jobs going at the moment all around Australia because there isn't anybody with experience to do any of the jobs. So I hope you find that information helpful. And if you're looking to get into the industry, then my best advice is to go where the new starters are being hired. And at the moment, that's in Hard Rock Underground, a few pits around the mining towns. And of course, there's lots of offsider work going in expiration. They're always going through offsiders in expiration, but some things never change. So I hope you find that information helpful. And if you've got another best shot question that you want answered, please send it through. And if you could like and subscribe the channel. Thank you.